Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for coming out to Pearl River High School for our winter concert. Tonight's concert is featuring our band members, talented music and choir members. Um, we've been working very hard. I know for me and the band, we've been starting the music since about October. Uh, I have to start it back then because Christmas comes really quick. We got a holiday in the middle of there where we lose a lot of days, and then you just never know with sickness and everything. So I'm really happy with everything that's turned out for this concert. Um, it's been a pleasure to teach these kids and to see their progress, to know where they were last year's Christmas concert compared to this one. I can honestly say it is 10 times better. Um, and I'm happy for them, and thank you for letting me teach y'all. All right, we're gonna start off our program with the 12 Days of Christmas, with the band as a feature on this one. Um, just finding new arrangements, trying to start off a concert with something nice and upbeat, and just getting things together. And 12 Days of Christmas is one of those that you, you're kind of thinking of what comes next, and saying the words all together. Okay, a little twist. All right, do the best she can. Um, Tori just told me, she, while handing out the music, she kind of dropped the folders, and they got a little mixed up. So hopefully this sounds okay. So um, if you hear something strange, don't worry, we'll get through it. So 12 Days of Christmas. <laughs> Of course, that was um, a mess up on purpose. Actually, the name of that title is A Crazy Mixed Up Christmas. Uh, it's an arrangement specifically made the composer was thinking, what would happen if 
the music folders all fell. And so I like to add a little twist to it and have the concerts be a little fun. Up next, we will feature both our talented music and choir as they come up to the stage. Come on, girls. Not only do I have the responsibility of being the band teacher, but I am also the choir teacher here at Pearl River High School. And um, we had an influx of freshmen, and I'm very happy that we did so, because the choir is sounding very nice this, when it will be formed to you this evening. Tonight's first piece for the Talented Music and Choir is two nativity carols. You should be able to hear them quite well. Uh, next, uh, something I like to do a lot is have something specifically 
for my senior members. This is their last winter concert here at Pearl River, so I want to give them a little bit of a spotlight. Um, this is a song I kind of arrange for just like a little small ensemble. Uh, years before, it has a collection of about four or five Christmas tunes to it. And it's literally just made it out. It's a little quartet thing that I arrange for my senior members. There's, and just want just to give them their own little spotlight, I guess you could say. So just give me a second to grab my trombone and we'll be right with you. <laughs>
next uh, is featuring some members of our talented music class. Actually, I believe all of them in the talented music class as they perform Santa Baby. <laughs> Santa baby, slip a sable under the tree for me. I've been an awful good girl, Santa honey. Hurry down the chimney tonight. Santa baby, a 54 convertible to light blue. I wait up for you, dear Santa honey. Hurry down chimney tonight think of all the fun I've missed think of all the fellas that I haven't kissed next year I could be just as good if you check off my Christmas list Santa honey I want it and really that's not All year, Santa, honey, hurry down the chimney tonight. Santa, honey, there's one thing that I really do need the deed to a platinum mine, Santa, honey, hurry down the chimney tonight. Baby, with the duplex and checks, sign your ex on the line, Santa honey, hurry down the chimney tonight. Come and trim my Christmas tree with some decorations bought at Tiffany. I really do. Let's see if you believe in me. Santa, honey, forgot to mention one little thing, a ring. And I don't mean on the phone. Santa, honey, hurry down the chimney tonight. Hurry down the chimney tonight. Next is changing gears again to our choir, and just our choir, not the talented music students. This is the one featuring only the choir students as they walk up on stage. Uh, Carol the Bells. Um, everybody knows the tune Ukrainian Bell Carol. This is where it's coming from. Uh, it, there's so many different renditions, and this is one that I found that I liked. And um, so, Carol of the Bells. Here, words of good cheer from everywhere filling the 
This next song features the band, and it's probably the song I worked on the most. When you have loud, fast notes, they know how to play that. For some reason, the loud, fast stuff, that's the easy stuff. It's the slow, in tune, precise, just the right dynamic to where it flows with everything else that makes a pretty song great. Um, this is probably one of my favorite Christmas carols within Noel. Um, the message within it, read through it. I can't think of it right now because I have concert on the brain. But Noel is just one of those sweet words and the, the common chorale tune to it is very nice. And the arrangement that they're gonna be playing is, I believe, one of the prettiest arrangements I've heard of Noel. So without further ado, Noel. Didn't I say it was pretty? All right, the next piece <clears throat> features one of our talented music students, Lauren Bunnell. Um, everybody knows Tchaikovsky's Nutcracker Suite, the story of the Rat King and the Toy Soldier. And uh, within that is Dance of the Sugar Plum Fairies, which, I mean, just a ballet that just happens to be during Christmas time. And here we go, Dance of the Sugar Plum Fairies. Thank you. 
All right, before we move on to our next song, I actually want to, if you're not already aware, we have some award-winning musicians in this group. Um, with the members of Crossfire, please come out to the front of the stage. These five members, all on their own, um, found out of that the International House of Blues, what foundation? Inter House, International House of Blues Foundation Young Musicians Competition. Um, they found out what, about two and a half months ago that they had the competition. They had a week to put in a demo tape. One day. One day to put in the, one day to put in the demo tape. In that day, they got the tape in. They got selected to perform. They had a month to work on the music. I guess it was about two weeks ago at the House of Blues. They performed uh, against, I think it was six other groups, and they won. <laughs> Within their winnings, um, they received an Xbox bundle. They received a $500 gift card to Guitar Center. They received 10 hours of recording time at a studio, which is Phenomenal. That right there is, I can't believe they got that. Also, there was a fan, fan favorite award, which of course they won because Pearl River rocked the house that night, uh, which I believe gave them another $100, $250 of, and how much? And 200 in House of Blues merchandise. So I am very proud of them. Happy to say I did not lead them at all in this, and they did it all on their own. So this is showing you that the music education is proving something and actually getting into their lives somehow. So I just want to say thank you again, guys, and congratulations. All right. This next piece um, I wanted to do, it's called Holiday Favorites. It's a collection of a few holiday songs, but it has everyone involved. I wanted to have something that had all the students involved, and sure enough, I did it with two songs. This is the first one, Holiday Favorites. If you know the words, you're more than welcome to sing along. Just keep it down. This is for them. The next one's where y'all can sing out.
we're going to move over to this side of the stage. Um, this young lady, Miss Brittany Nagrath, um, member of the Talented Music, also happens to be a member of the marching band as my majorette this year, my featured twirler, or spinner, whatever it is for majorettes, May feature majorette. So, and I was quite delighted when she decided to sing this song. That is, Mary Did You Know. Final selection is where you get to sing along. And if you don't know the words, it's in the insert of your program. <laughs> I, may, I simplify it for some people, just because you can, might remember the first verse of Deck the Halls, but you probably don't know the second verse of Deck the Halls. So this last song, once again, is for full participation, not only with the band, choir, and talented music, but I do invite the audience to sing out and be a part of this as well. So without further ado, Holiday Sing Along. Yeah. 